to my channel so today I have a special video because my girlfriend one of my best friend is getting married so well I'm a soon turn around so we're at an Airbnb in Mineral Lights and yo when they say a place nice it plays nice but anyway see bright here to be upset this yes, I'm kind of rocky but hi Hi. Wait, let me fast and show me, please. Lick a bit. I'm going to show you guys much for tonight. However, we're going to our bed pretty soon because we have a busy, busy day tomorrow. I have to put on our wig and I have to do her makeup. And yeah, hopefully. We get help, so stay tuned, stay tuned. Hi, sister. Ball cap method in process, yes. Trying to get this wig slayed. So this is her wig so far. We're going to put some curls at the end. But we're going to start with her makeup. So I'm going to use my Becca primer as always. So I'm just going to apply some primer on her brows first. And then I'm going to use the spoolie and comb it out. Normally, I don't think I've ever applied my Becca on a client for their facial primer. But I decided to do it today on my girl. Um, I'm applying it on the parts that shine the most which is her nose her cheek and her forehead and then after that i am going to use her fenty um powder in hazelnut and i'm just going to use this to set the primer on her brows so we do this technique in order for whenever we're using the pencil so the pencil glides on smoother on the skin I am just concealing underneath and above her brows with her foundation and then I'm going to go in after with my elf comma concealer underneath her brows so my friend she brought her own foundation and powder and makeup brushes so the foundation and the powder are from Fenty Beauty and the makeup brushes are from Sono Casio so if you see me using some straight black brushes they are from Sonia Casho and I really like the brushes they're very soft and nice and easy to work with they blend out the foundation and the concealer so well
I really love going in with this technique. So basically after you finish carving out your brows or shaping out your brows, then you would go in with a brow pomade. So what this does is it makes your the ends of your brows more sharper or it makes it stand out more if you understand what I mean. I went in with my P. Louise base in the shade number two. Is it a base or a concealer? I don't know, but it's shade number two. And I'm just buffing this onto her eyelids with one of the brushes from the Sonia Casio set. And then I am going to go in with her primer, her second primer, because remember I applied the Becca primer first and now i am just applying my milk primer and i never done that before but something just told me to try it out this time around and i really really loved how it turned out so now i'm going in with her foundation from fenty i don't know the shade or well i don't remember the shade but this is her foundation and i am applying it with the sonio cashew foundation brush To contour her face, I'm going in with my favorite foundation, and that is a black opal. So this is the black opal foundation stick in the shade Ebony. And I'm going to use my Real Technique brush to blend that out. To her eyes so i am using her fenty powder in the shade hazelnut to set underneath her brows and y'all know my favorite eyeshadow palettes are from juvia's place so i'm going to use all juvia's place palettes and you don't have to know the name or the shades i'm going to show you guys all of the palettes on camera <laughs> I mean, I don't know if I'm going to give you a little bit of a little bit of a
already added a little bit of camo concealer in the shade chestnut and that's the elf camo concealer in the shade chestnut and i just added a little bit underneath her eyes and now i'm just blending it out whatever that's left on the brush i'm going to add it to her nose her forehead and underneath her chin To set her highlighted areas, I'm going to use my Maybelline powder in the shade 360 and I'm going to use this nice fluffy brush from the Sonia Casio set to apply the powder. And my photographer for today is Iconic Imaging. So if you guys want beautiful pictures on your special day, go and check him out on Instagram. Her eyeliner was from Sephora and now I am just contouring her face with the Black Radiance Deep to Dark Powder. This lipstick is Shanique's personal lipstick and it's from Max. I don't know the shade. However, I just applied her lipstick and then I darkened around the edges, giving it a nice like a darkened amber look. My bride, her makeup turned out beautiful. Normally I would do brows, then eyes, then face. Today I did brows and face then eyes and I really really liked how it turned out so I think I'm going to do this step more often than my original step. I applied her lashes off camera and now I'm just finishing up her eyes and this was her requested look. She wanted smoky eyes with red lips but she still wanted to look natural on the face and she looks absolutely beautiful. I'm just going to finish off her face with the Skindonavia setting spray and I'm going to curl her hair off camera. I'm a say girl, I'm not telling a lie, my good, good friend, girl. You look good. You look so, so beautiful and I'm so proud of you for you to take this big step in your life. And I love you, and you know that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you for watching. You'll see another video coming soon. Bye. Smile. You see, I got the smile that we need. Furious idea. Yes.
Vem aí, vamos ver como começa. É o que não é que é mais, né? Na frente é que é mais. Na frente é que é mais. Ih, Rachel. Rachel, vamos ver. Try it, try it. No, real one. A real one! <laughs> Kenny, that looks so beautiful. Yeah. Send you the money. Send it Look, my we're friends! Oh my god! Oh, I'm gonna be good. He's gonna get on it. He looks so. This is why I'm in a 